Hello and welcome to the video for fifth grade for Tuesday, April the 28th. This is going to be the homework from our lesson working with elapsed time and doing um, conversion uh, between different units related to time. So let's go ahead and take a look at our problems. I'm going to attempt to try to speed run this um, and not have everything written in advance. So um, eight hours times 60 minutes. Uh, will give us, um, let's see, 480 minutes. Uh, the next one, 15 hours would be equal to um, 15 times 60. So 60 times 10 would give me 600, plus 300, which would be half of that, would give us 900 minutes. Um, days. So this one is going to be 24 times 7, which should be 1, uh, sorry, 168. I almost said 148. Forgot to carry my 2. All right, number 7, 24 hours. So we are going with this times 60 again. Um, this one might be beneficial to actually write out. And so I would choose to do it this way so I can start with my zero. And then we've got 24, carry the two, so 1,440 minutes. And that's actually not the problem we're supposed to do. Hooray. 600 seconds is equal to eight, is equal to uh, 10 minutes. So this is the one, uh, 60 seconds per minute. Uh, we can multiply that by 10. Five minutes is 300 seconds, uh, which if some of you have played um, certain video games like the old Super Mario Brothers, they give you a counter that's like 300 or 400 seconds to do a level. That means you get almost five minutes or sometimes more uh, to do that, depending on what the timer says. So start time of 11 a.m. We go forward uh, from there four hours and five minutes. That takes us to noon, 1 to 3 p.m. and five minutes. So it would be 3.05 p.m. And then this one we are counting backward uh, from 6 p.m. So six hours to get back to noon, three hours uh, to get back to 9 a.m. And then uh, three quarters of an hour would take us back to 8.15 a.m. Uh, let's see, Kira's dance class starts at 4.30 p.m., ends at 6.15, so 4.30 to 6 would give us 90 minutes, um, or an hour and a half, plus 15 minutes, so you could either say 105 minutes, or 1 hour, 45 minutes. Uh, we're skipping number 16. Number one on the back. So this one, we started at 6.45 a.m., went to um, 3.28 p.m. So we could say that we go 15 minutes uh, to get up to 7. And then we are going forward five hours to get to noon and three more hours to get to 3 p.m. So that would be eight hours and 15 minutes so far that's accounted for. Plus... Um, 28. So that would give us 43 minutes. And so that should be eight hours and 43 minutes. And that should be an H. So eight hours, 43 minutes. If we are doing it uh, that way, if you wanted to do the number of minutes, we would do something slightly different. Um, so number two on the back, we've got 8 a.m. for the start time. Four hours takes us exactly to noon. Uh, 49 minutes after that would be 12.49 p.m. So those are the problems for the homework for today. Um, if you have any questions, apart from my one mistake where I actually did the wrong problem for a moment, um, apologies for that. I did give the correct answer for it, but we didn't have to do that one. Um, so if you have any questions, please feel free to ask in Google Classroom. Hope you have a wonderful day, and I will see you in the next video, which will be tomorrow.